Hi, my name is Nicole Hemrick. I want to talk to you today about removal of conditions and naturalization. If you and your spouse have filed a removal of conditions, you may have noticed that it takes USCIS a very long time to adjudicate these cases. Right now, for all the service centers, the case completion timelines are showing that 80% of cases are completed within 34 and a half months. That's almost three years. Of course, there are outliers on both sides. Now, the issue here is that if you are married to a U.S. citizen, you're supposed to be eligible to apply for naturalization in two years and nine months from when you first became a resident, meaning when you got your conditional green card. Some people think that they have to wait until their I-751 is decided upon and they have their 10-year green card in order to apply for naturalization. I'll let you in on a little secret. That's not true. You can file for naturalization while your I-751 is pending. And what's so great about this is that while I-751s take so long to become adjudicated, naturalization cases don't. In New York City, many people are getting called for interviews within two or three months from when they apply for naturalization. And what happens if you have a pending I-751 when you go in for your naturalization interview, USCIS is going to adjudicate both of these cases together. So it will substantially cut down your time to have your citizenship. If you would like help with this or any other matter, please feel free to call my office, Hemrick O'Malley, PLLC. Our telephone number is 833-848-7838. Thank you very much.